issue in Ocoin on 10 September. So this is our chart that would likely to be explained on today. So this is our trend line this week. Well, is a major explanation for all the technical analysis on the chart because it has several supports. Okay, about two supports, three, four supports, and about three. Okay, five, I think, and this these are two resistances. So that circles was arrows indicating for the resistances and the remaining are indicating by the supporters so since this we have this part is indicating by support we have to connect this trend line with another support on the chart with a slope line also it doesn't matter if it's going to make a connection with a resistance because it's going to be uh, it may be a resistance itself so as you can see it seems that it's a resistance but it's actually a support because if it was a resistance it would need to increase the decline. I don't think it's going to be a resistance right here because this goes to be according to the price set it, de it may decrease before it after it and before it it would decrease in momentum so every time we see a support before it a decrease and after it maybe a decrease and increase but for a resistance we have to see an increase so after it would be likely to be an increase and usually it would be making the rebound of the decrease or uh, on or maybe the decrease more than the increase so all we have to know is that we have to make the connection of this line to this support and since we do that we have to notice that there is another trend line this is going to make an intersection for the next part here and it's making an increase in momentum for the next wave or a new wave viruses and this is indication for the increase in momentum in Kisho, Inu, and I hope you benefit from this video.